This week in agribusiness, always proud to get to know our FFAers from around the country. And this week we're meeting Bailey Peterson. She just completed her term as the Minnesota FFA State Sentinel. Bailey, tell us what was convention like in Minnesota this year? Absolutely. Thank you for having me today. And a little bit about convention. So as um, our interviewer said, I got done about a month ago uh, being the state sentinel for this year. And along with my five teammates, we lead the state of a convention in Minnesota. So that's held at Mariucci Arena um, in the Twin Cities. And there are over about 5,000 people present. Some members, parents, guests, people being recognized, sponsors, about 5,000 people in total there to celebrate FFA, compete in contests and receive awards. So lots of excitement there. Bailey, was this the first year back in person since the coronavirus outbreak? Yes, it was. We actually had two conventions online. One was completely online, and then one of them had the last session in person only for selected people. So um, I myself, I was running to be a state officer, so I got to attend that session. But yes, this is our first convention back in person, and you could definitely see the excitement and the members that wanted to be there. And actually, from my home chapter, there were no members that had ever gone to convention before that were at convention this year. So especially a lot of excitement and a little bit of nerves as they got to go to convention for the first time. I bet that's fantastic. Bailey, I'm curious though, for our viewers who maybe weren't involved in FFA, can you tell us what the duties of the Sentinel are? Absolutely. So at the state level, there is the president, of course, vice president, secretary, treasurer, reporter, and then the Sentinel. Those are the six uh, officers at the state level. And we are actually considered equal in our duties. There's a few duties that officers have. For example, the reporter usually runs our social media pages or heads that up. And then our president does a little bit more of the public speaking. And as Sentinel, my job is to welcome members into FFA and people that aren't in FFA and help them understand what it is but also um, just speak at different events, give um, an invocation if needed, and be part of the team like everybody else is. Bailey, what was it that prompted you to join FFA? What prompted me is I actually started showing cattle when I was about five or six. My parents wanted me to learn responsibility and time management, so they got me in 4-H, and along with my brothers, we started showing cattle, and then later pigs. And since I knew that through FFA, I could show livestock at the, at the state fair, I wanted to jump into FFA. Um, after I joined, I knew that I wanted to become a chapter officer, where similar duties would be held, but at the chapter group chapter level. Uh, I wanted to compete in career development events and I judged livestock um, and then I did an interview contest. So I was excited to get involved in my community but also in an agricultural way because I've had such a background in agriculture for so long that I wanted to maintain that in high school. That is fantastic and I understand you're in college pursuing a future career in agriculture. Bailey Peterson past Minnesota State FFA Sentinel. Thanks for joining us on This Week in Agribusiness and we wish you the best. Thank you for having me today.